Howdy guys, Relay Sitch15 here. Today we're going to be reviewing the Accu Battery app. So, let's review it. it uh, it's one of the best apps to see your battery health on your Android phone. So it takes a few charge cycles, but it eventually gets it. So I would go for the Pro version because you get dark mode and you get extra features like... You get the, I don't know what you exactly get. You get, uh, what do you get? So you get like the different overlay settings. It's like $4, but I think it's worth it. You get the themes, which I like the AMOLED dark, so, yeah, I would, I would buy the pro version, because it's just a really good app, but, anyway, sorry, I am having trouble looking at the camera, because I'm not used to recording, uh, these types of videos on my phones, but, anyway, this is the charging, you set a charging alarm, because you're supposed to only charge your phone 80%, but I don't use that, because, I charged my phone and I got mine only for the battery health. So my phone battery is at 87%. I use wireless charging slow, not fast wireless charging, slow wireless charging every night on my 15 watt Samsung wireless charger. But anyway, uh, I can see the history of how much, how many charge cycles you're wearing down. I wore down to uh, 0 0.92. But anyway, it's a really good app. It, uh, it's definitely worth the four dollars. I would get it. It um, it's a pretty good app. Just move that over. Anyway, it uh, it's definitely worth four dollars. I would if if you don't want to pay for it, the free version is pretty good too. It still lets you show the battery health. It's just easier on my eyes for the dark mode, so I bought the the pro version. But anyway, guys, it uh, it's a really good app. I would get it. It uh. I would get the other free version, pro version. I recommend the pro version just because it's better for your battery on your phone and everything. But anyway, it'll let you know. Like I think you have to start replacing your battery on like seventy five percent battery health. But it'll give you an idea because on my my aunt's iPhone, she said her phone kept telling her to replace her battery because she has an iPhone seven. Kept telling her to replace her battery at seventy five percent battery health capacity health. You you have. Not, it doesn't always detect your battery health, so you have to. Um, so what you have to do sometimes. Let me show you. You have to. Oh no, you don't go there. Go to settings. Where the fuck do you go? Sorry for my language. Uh. Anyway, where do you freaking go? Oh, okay, here it is. So on the charging tab, you can set your capacity. It said minus 4,000, so it won't always say your battery minus 4,100. So, because I have the S10 Plus, it said minus 4,000. So, it doesn't always say your design capacity out of the, or after you're downloading the app. So, you set it, and just type in the number. You could, if you don't know your battery capacity, just look it up online. You're, you just need to know your phone name, like OnePlus Pro iPhone. 8 plus whatever so anyway uh this app i do think it's worth it get get the pro version just because the dark mode's easier than the battery and it's easier on your eyes especially if you have blue eyes because your eyes are more sensitive to light <laughs> like me i have blue eyes so anyway um i do definitely recommend it it'll let you know when you need to get your battery replaced so especially if these newer phones that you can't have an easy replaceable battery like or use a removable battery you have to like heat gun and all that so those because we want to make sure we're replacing the battery at the right time because we don't want to spend money else we don't have to so with samsung phones you should go to the i, bre I break it you fix it they're partnered with samsung it's authorized samsung so repair your place so you can um, keep the waterproofing if you've never had the back glass replaced but anyway guys um this is where you can see your battery health, so you can have an idea of when you need to replace it. I would say around 75% battery health. <sighs> but I guess you could deal with the bad battery life. But 
I would replace it at 75% battery health because that's when my aunt's phone was warning her to replace her battery. But anyway, guys, um, this is my review on the Accu Battery Pro and Standard Edition app. Let me know your thoughts in the description below. Do you guys, uh, do you guys want to be able to, do you wish that Android had the, the battery health built in by default? I kind of wish it did, but this app is, gives me the features I need for not having to switch to iPhone. So <laughs> I really don't want to switch to iPhone because I don't like it. But anyway, guys, this is my review on the AccuBattery Pro and standard version of the app, free version of the app. Let me know your guys' thoughts in the description below. This is Riley SH15 signing out, guys. Have a good one. Hope you guys uh, enjoyed the video. Bye.